In today's video, I talk about the value of tracking and exactly what it can do to help change your fitness level and change your life. This is something that we need to talk about. We need to discuss it. Yo, what's up guys? Frank Daniels here. Today I'm talking the value of tracking and just what it can do to help you change your life. Before I do that, I have a free core training report, my nine best tips on how to build a rock solid core. If you want to do that, you can download that free by clicking this link right here. Mobile device users, I've done you the favor by putting it as the first link in the description down below. Now let's talk tracking and what that's all about. Basically, all successful people in life, entrepreneurs, business people, athletes, you name it, are trackers. They track the things that they do and the stats that they have in order to be able to improve those things, generally on an incremental basis. But people who end up not being so successful are lacking in awareness of the things that are going on. So especially when it comes to your training and your fitness, tracking in itself is going to bring about an awareness of something that you probably weren't thinking about improving in the first place. And one of the biggest things or problems I see with people in their training is this kind of haphazard, you know, workouts, just kind of jump in the gym and do any workout that makes me feel happy on a given day. Um, I don't want to downplay anyone just kind of getting off their butt and, and being able to, uh, you know, get out there and, and do something. But training is different than working out. So a lot of people, they work out, makes them feel good, makes them feel accomplished. Again, I won't knock that. But training is the thing that actually helps you change your body. Uh, so when it comes to training, it's knowing the specifics about the weight you're lifting, being in a structured program, as well as nutrition. If you really want to change your body, your nutrition is structured. You got a way that you approach those things. You're tracking them. You're changing them on an incremental basis. So again, to me, the biggest problem with most people why they get mediocre results is because they haphazardly go into a gym or do this you know, type of workout this day, this type of workout that day. Um, they're really not tracking their approach to what they're doing. A great book to get on the subject is The Compound Effect by Darren Hardy, the CEO of Success Magazine, obviously a very successful guy himself, um, but interviews the top entrepreneurs um, and most successful people on the planet on a regular basis. So you can certainly pick up some tips. And I hate to use such a blanket statement like success, but um, you know these things, these same principles, you know that happen in business, happen in entrepreneurship, happen in health and fitness, happen in any area of your life. Are you know they just transfer? Okay, and successful people have a certain way that they do specific things that lead them to a phenomenal result. And generally that is track the areas of their life that they're trying to improve. So a lot of times you have just like zero awareness of the things that are either um, hurting you or helping you move towards your goals. So the minute you start tracking stuff or writing stuff down or just trying to figure out what's going on brings about an awareness that has you register whether or not you're um, becoming unsuccessful or becoming more successful at the thing that you're trying to do. Just the act of starting to log um, and recognize the things that you're eating is enough to start to physically change people, change their perception on you know what's going on in terms of food. But once again, there's, there's a lot of ways to track that stuff. Even if you just wrote it down um, on a daily or weekly basis, you wanna figure out what you're putting in your body, get your calories, get your macros right, and help to improve your body um, through that tracking process. Again, when it comes to your health and fitness, you gotta be understanding your stats. And then, like an athlete, um, you look at your stats and you look to improve those things incrementally, and that's how you improve um, your physical fitness, your physical appearance, and your goddamn life. That's what it's all about. You wanna improve stuff, doesn't matter what it is, start to track it, and that's what it's all about. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you really did, I got a free core training report, my nine best tips on how you can develop a shredded midsection. You can download that by clicking this link right here. Mobile device users, head down below, click the first link in the description. If you really enjoyed this video, I'd love for you to head below, like, leave a comment, and of course, subscribe to this channel right here. My name is Frank Daniels, guys. Enjoy your goddamn day Level. and change your life. You don't want to talk about that? We need to talk about that. Oh man, I need some external rotation. Value and purpose. The purposeful value. Let's talk about it.
Um, it's something that you have to just kind of build as you go. But little positive, let's fucking start again.